Welcome to our course on common stock. When a company needs money to start up operations or expand, it can decide to sell shares of the company to people who want to invest. When you invest in a company, you become a shareholder who now owns a part of the company and you stake a claim in the future of that company and all potential investment return that it may bring. Unless you've invested in a company before and dealt with stock, you might not know that there are different classes of stock that a company issues to shareholders. The most common class of stock is called common stock. What exactly is common stock? It's just one class of stock that a company you invest in can issue to you when you become a shareholder in the company. Owners of common stock will benefit from a dividend if it is declared, and they will also benefit from capital appreciation of the company. As the company's value increases, so does the value of common stock. Common stock may or may not have voting rights depending on which type the company decides to issue. Another important characteristic of common stock is the order of payment distributed if the company undergoes a liquidation. This can happen if the company is terminated or goes bankrupt. When this happens, the assets are sold and the proceeds are paid to creditors, bondholders, preferred shareholders, and other debt holders before paying out common stockholders. Therefore, it is important to know that common stock carries a greater risk than preferred stock, and that should be taken into consideration when deciding to invest. Thanks for watching this course. We'll see you soon. Stay tuned.